Hello everyone, this is Brady, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to actually merge videos together. Now, this is going to come with a couple things. I'm going to be showing you how to actually trim videos up before you merge them together, even put transitions between the two clips. Also going to be showing you how to mute the audio slash change the audio on these clips. So when you go to merge your videos, you're going to make sure they are absolutely perfect. This is super easy, super plug and play. We're going to be using a video editor called NVIDIA. Link is in the description to follow along. With that being said, let's get started. Once you click the link in the description, the first thing you gotta do is go ahead and sign up for a completely free account. It should only take you a minute or two. Just you need a username, password, email, and your phone number. Once you've done that, you're gonna be on this screen with me. Now there is some pre-made templates. We're not gonna be messing with them, judging how we're only merging two clips together. You wanna go ahead and use a blank canvas. So you wanna click blank canvas, and I'm gonna go ahead and the dimensions wide 16 by nine because those are the video clips I'm using, and you wanna click make a video. So now you're actually in the editor. Now here we can go to actually upload media. So this is where you're gonna upload your two clips we're gonna be working on. But you're going to see that we have a scene right here so we're going to be merging two clips so i'm going to go ahead and just add a scene add a blank scene here it's going to say add new scene hit yes and you're going to see that we got two of the exact same uh, scenes here and they're obviously going to have these default text so i'm just going to go ahead and delete both these things on each scene because we don't really need these these are just default template items so now we actually have two completely blank scenes. So I'm going to be merging a clip of me just trying to, you know, work the editor and everything like that. So you can actually see that right here we have this little line that says edit to current scene. So if I click this, it's going to actually fit it to the current scene. I actually want the whole clip, so I'm really not going to worry about that. I'm going to go ahead and extend it all the way back to its original form. Now you guys can also go ahead and go back like this. If you want to cut out a certain part, you can hit add section and you can cut a completely, you know, middle part out if you don't want it. The editor is pretty straightforward. I'm not actually going to touch my clips at all. So I'm going to keep them just like this. I'm going to hit use full video and you're going to see that it puts it in for me. Now you're going to see right here, there actually is some audio, which is going to be default music that they actually put in the scene automatically. We don't really want that. I actually don't want any audio on any of my clips. So I'm going to go ahead and delete the background audio. And you're going to hear that this video clip actually already has sound. But if you want to get rid of your video clip, you want to get rid of the sound. Let's say you're making a montage. You just want to click on your video. There's going to be an edit button over here. You want to go to volume. You can turn your volume all the way down. Another way to do it is actually just go to video edit it. Um, and actually turn a volume off by clicking the volume off button. But now that I have everything good on the first clip, I have no audio just like I wanted. I can actually go to the second scene right here, which is still blank, drag my other clip in here. You're gonna see that it's actually loading. And then we're gonna bring up the trim menu again. This time I actually am going to um, cut a certain section out. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit add, um, add section here. And I just want it to the point of where I actually start playing the game, which was about around here. Let me go ahead and back up just until I see um, where I actually pause the game. So I'm basically paused in the game up until about right here. So I'm going to go ahead and drag that all the way here. And just to make sure I got all that done, we're going to go ahead and hit done. And you're going to see that it is going to add our new scene in here. Again, I'm going to do the exact same thing by going to video edit, going to volume off, turning it off. And there you go. My second clip is already in. Now I'm going to show you guys how to actually do the transitions on these videos. So normally we got our normal video here where I'm actually talking, you know, going here and then it actually just automatically transfers over to my gaming clip. But if I actually want to make a super smooth transition, all I got to do is drag over here, click this button here, it says tap to edit, and it's going to have a bunch of transitions. Now just by holding your mouse over here, it's going to show you what they do. So for example, a zoom in transition, I'm going to go ahead and put that on there. Now when I play this, it should do the transition just like that. Now there's tons and tons of ones to choose from just by clicking here, going to here, and you're going to see a ton of transitions. Like I said, a bunch of newly added ones. So feel free to actually check those out and mess with them yourself. Now, since I actually don't have any audio on this clip, whether it's from me or from actual the NVIDIA editor itself, I can go ahead and go to music up top and there's tons and tons of default music to choose from like rock, you name it. So I'm going to go ahead and just click it and just add it to my scene. It's going to default add to my scene. And there you guys have it. You can also use the edit volume button like I showed you earlier. Instead of turning it down to zero, you can play with that a little bit. But that is essentially all we really needed for this video. I showed you guys how to trim. I showed you guys how to do transitions. And of course, I showed you how to merge two videos together. Last step is just going to the top right screen, hitting download and share. It's going to bring up this export menu. You just want to hit export. It's going to load into the rendering here. You're going to see that there is a share video button up here and a download. So you can share it directly from the NVIDIA or you can just go ahead and download it from 
the browser and there you go you've merged two videos together if you guys did enjoy this video and find it helpful make sure you of course like the video go ahead and subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell right up there if you guys want to learn how to create thumb stopping videos using nvidia we have tons of more tutorials for you guys and it's very very plug and play for all your editing needs that playlist will be right up here that being said i'm brady and i'll catch you guys in the next video